Dalton police are searching for those responsible for vandalizing several American prisoner of war and missing in action flags at the Whitfield County Courthouse over the weekend. Channel 3's Travis Cummings joins us now live in the studio and he spoke to a few people who had a part in placing those flags and no doubt, Travis, no surprise, they are disappointed about this. Yeah, Latrice, you're right. More than 700 flags are posted on the Whitfield County Courthouse lawn for all of our patriotic holidays throughout the year. And the person who leads the effort says he saw some of those flags thrown into trees, scattered around the parking deck and around local businesses. He says he's completely disheartened to have that happen on the 20th anniversary of 9-11. Dalton is a pretty good place to live up until this weekend. That's what's on the heart of U.S. veteran George Logreco now. After witnessing a number of American prisoner of war and missing in action flags torn down and others missing from the Whitfield County Courthouse lawn. This weekend was the most disgusting, dissatisfying. The same weekend marking 20 years since nearly 3,000 lives were lost when America was attacked on September 11th. Greco, who served in the Marine Corps for a decade and one year in the National Guard, has led the avenue of flags through the American Legion Post 112 for a number of years. Each one of them dedicated to a U.S. service member who gave the ultimate sacrifice. Uh, veterans that served in World War II, Korea, Vietnam. Dalton Fire Chief Todd Pangle also disheartened by the vandalism. While his crews can't associate directly with the loss of 9-11, he says it's something they can relate to and take very seriously. It's really kind of gut-wrenching and, and uh, uh, you know, disappointing, especially on a day uh, that was meant to celebrate the courage of so many. Greco is working to put the flags back in their rightful place to make sure the people whose lives they represent do not go in vain. He has that same wish for those who pass them by. I'm hoping that our society can grow from this and learn to respect veterans more than this. Well, if you're interested in helping out with the flags, give Greco a call at 706-260-6611. Officials say cameras are installed at the courthouse, but they were unfortunately off for the weekend. And if you have any information about this incident, you can call the Dalton Police Department at 706-278. 9085. In the studio, Travis Cummings, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.